the books you won't put down. Grab the House of Lazenberry series by author Daniel Webb since his controversial interview at the Hip Hop Uncensored podcast. The books can't stay on the shelf. Grab the series, The House of Lazenberry, The House of Lazenberry 1978, and The House of Lazenberry, A Time to Hill. Link in the description box now. What up, what up, y'all? It's your man Sam, and here at Viral Hip Hop News, go ahead and hit that like button. Smash that notification bell, and if you're not subscribed to Vile Hip Hop News, ladies and gentlemen, what are you waiting for? Subscribe right now to The Brand. Appreciate each and every one of y'all, and let's get to work. All right, last night was Grammy night, and I'm not going to lie, it was a pretty dope event. We've seen a lot of hip hop acts. We've seen a lot of tribute to hip hop. One of those tributes being Quavo giving tribute to his lost cousin, his family member, Takeoff, who was unfortunately taken away from us during... Halloween of 2022 well Jay Prince has done numerous interviews talking about this situation because obviously his son was there it was an event ran and thrown by his son so when it happened obviously there was a lot of rumors being circulated about the Prince family and their involvement with Takeoff's murder well Jay Prince has been on numerous interviews denying any involvement giving condolences to the family he was on million dollars worth of game a few days ago I believe and now there's a video circulating with Jay Prince speaking directly to Offset. He has some pretty strong words to say to Offset. Obviously, Offset's relationship with the Migos team has definitely soured in recent months. Unfortunately, it soured during a time where his real-life family member was taken from him and they had to play it out all in the public eye. Well, Jay Prince has some strong words to say to Offset. Offset returned fire back to Jay Prince and the family. This is getting very, very messy and very, very disturbing. I don't know what to make of it, but hopefully everybody, cooler heads will prevail. People can talk behind the scenes. But without further ado, let's listen to what Jay Prince and Offset have to say, and then I'll come back with my thoughts on the situation. Let's go. Offset, dude. I ain't gonna leave him out. You know, I'm just real like this, you know, because, you know, you know, niggas be throwing rocks and hiding their hand, right? They be throwing rocks and hiding their hand. And, uh, I don't like them kind of individuals, you know, and, and the truth of the matter is, you know, one can, can dance and different things in front of these different cameras and, and all that kind of shit. And, and, re, and, and when reality, the truth of the matter is, you know, nigga, you wasn't really right there with take off when he was alive. You know what I mean? So for you to be taking these, Positions that you taking, you know what I mean? And I, I got people everywhere, so I hear all kinds of things. Uh, I'm going to just say this to you. Uh, don't never put me in no position where, you know, I have to defend myself. You know what I mean? That wouldn't be healthy for you. And, you know, I, I have to say that. I hate, but it's a million dollars worth of game. You know what I mean? It's a million dollars worth of game, and I'm going to give it to him. Right on a million dollars worth of game because I ain't going to throw rocks and hide my hand. I'm going to just let it be known, you know, to him because I hear what's being said. And uh, it's all love after that. What y'all niggas got? What the fuck y'all niggas got going on? Y'all niggas speaking on my real brother. How dare one of y'all niggas even speak on me and Tate relationship, nigga? I don't know you niggas from a can of paint, nigga. Y'all niggas don't know how me and my brother rock, nigga. You trying to clear your face, nigga. You, this your fifth interview, nigga. You done did about my brother, nigga. You ain't think about his mama. You ain't think about the family, nigga. We ain't said nothing. Ain't nobody said nothing but you niggas. You niggas, man, who y'all nigga think y'all nigga is? John got it, nigga. Ain't nobody going for none of that, bro. I ain't stunning none of that shit y'all nigga talking about either. And if you heard something from me, I'm going to tell you it's, 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 it's going to come from me. Call my phone. Y'all nigga going off of he say, she say. Then y'all nigga supposed to be this is who, who y'all supposed to be. And y'all nigga on interviews and it out on an interview talking about I said that nigga, call my phone, homie. You call my phone, we'll have a conversation. They're going to talk about all that plant internet, internet games. All right, we heard what both brothers had to say, and this is what I'll say real quick, and I'll get out of here. Hopefully this situation can get off the computer, off the phones, off the internet, and into a private setting where men can discuss situations like men. Whatever needs to be aired out can be aired out privately, and we can move forward. Like I said, as men, one thing I hate about the Internet when we see real situations happen is people jumping on their phone or jumping on the computers or whatever the case may be and airing out these real situations in front of 
a live audience almost as if it's a tv show being played with real lives i just i've never been a fan of that i know that i have an internet business and things like that but when it comes to personal shit or real shit going on i'm going to direct my attention to you personally and i will not get on this computer and that's just my personal thing that's how i move and i wish to see more ogs moving like that because that's how i was raised i didn't make that up on my own i was taught to move in a certain way and i was taught by people who are on the internet now talking so it's honestly very unfortunate and it is what it is at this point it's a type type of day or a day and age that we live in i should say but leave a comment in the comment section let me know what you think of this situation i appreciate each and every one of y'all like the video like i just alluded to and if you deem this video worthy enough for sharing your social media platform i definitely appreciate it but until next time until next story sam and ceo of the brand viral hip-hop news i love each and every one of y'all love yourselves and i'm out of here peace